and in second year, I'm going to be your host for today's event. An entrepreneur is a person who has the possession of enterprise, venture, or idea, and is accountable for the inherent risk and the outcome. As we know, Ministry of Education (MOE), Government of India, is making strong efforts to make innovation and entrepreneurship emerge as one of the focal points of our education system, as well as to create a vibrant local innovation system. Taking part in this initiative. Institutions Innovation Council, CIT 5.4 presents today's workshop on innovative project bootcamp, learn to innovate, and seminar on uh, reviewing the potential business benefits of FPGs. Welcome all of you to this wonderful session, where I would like to introduce you all to today's speakers, Dr. Shishendu Roy, Mr. Avik Kumar Das, and. Today, they will share their inspiring stories to inspire our young minds to emerge out as one of the successful entrepreneurs of tomorrow. I would like to call on the dais, Professor Dr. Arpita Chakrabarti, Madam President of ICTIT 5.0, Professor Dr. Tapan Kumar Pal, Vice President of ICTIT 5.0. Now, I would like to call Swamiji Bhunya. I would like to call Speaker Dr. Shishindu Roy Sir and uh, Mr. Abhik Das to the dais. I have a seat, sir. <laughs> now, I would like to call Swamiji Bhunya of CSC First Year and Abhi Dev. CAC first year to felicitate our guests and respected professor. Tomini <laughs> Bhunya, please felicitate our IC president, Dr. Ardhita Chakrabarti. We felicitate our IC Vice President, Dr. Tapan Kumar Das. Sorry, Dr. Tapan Kumar Das. And now, Swamini Kunya, we felicitate Professor Debrina Barik, convener of IC GIT 5.0. Then you have to convert it into a product. 
So one by one the teams are coming in line. First the idea generation competition and today you are going to participate in this uh, workshop. Yeah, during this time you will be learning how to make the projects. Sirs, uh, the, our admin speakers are here, they will guide you how to make the projects in real time. And after that we will be coming up with the product making competitions. Okay. So be ready for that and during the process try to learn as much as possible from our today's uh, speakers. Thank you that, that much. So my dear student, my dear fellow colleagues and the unique speaker for the today's seminar and with uh, workshops. So this is one of the important opportunity for uh, those students that you are going to face different type of hackathons in all India basis, in institute levels as well as international level. So this is very important to take some idea and what is this different area that is very emerging for creating any kind of prototypes. So I think this is very uh, opportunity for to you that you took different type of knowledge for today's seminar and workshop and I think this is very fruitful for you. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Good afternoon everybody. I heartily welcome our eminent speakers, uh, Omid Kumar Das and Dr. Shishan Nuran. They have come here to give, our, to give their speech on uh, prototyping model. As you, we all know, prototype building is a very main part in our project. It might be a CAC project, IT project, or a C. So we build a prototype to demonstrate the uh, know-how of how the project will work. So today, I heartily welcome our speakers as well as the first year students and some of the second year students who were really enthusiastic to attend the seminar. And uh, our fellow colleagues. So I hope this seminar will be a very fruitful one. We will know how to build a prototype and you will, uh, they will demonstrate it. And hope you will build your own project and uh, participate in different hackathons and make us proud. Thank you all. Thank you so much ma'am for your words. I would like to request Arpita Ma'am, Tapan Sir and Devulina Ma'am to take a seat in the audience. But I, I enjoyed his, uh, the way he interacted with the all the students. So, I heartily, I should not say now welcome, I heartily thank both of you because of good lectures and uh, as he said that our IAC team, they are providing a platform for the first year students uh, to know about what is advanced technology, how this works so that in future in, uh, in future, when you are making a project, you just think about all the projects, what they have uh, taught you. So, I heartily welcome as well as and say thank you to both the speakers on behalf of VIT. And I also thank our IACT and faculties and above all, all the students here, all the students and who have organized this event to make it a success. So, uh, I should, at the end, one should not give a lecture. Am I right? Because you have already uh, made your brain full with the, all the words. And I enjoyed Mr. Obiku Mantar the way he interacted at the end, giving the example of football. You know, uh, say football, now World Cup football will you know, almost. And he has linked this with the IOT. That is the Track of his good comments 
narrating everything by one words, you know. So thank you very much. Thank you so so much. From West Bengal University of Technology and Indian Institute of Engineering Science and Technology IIEST Shirpur. He worked as assistant professor in Seacom Engineering College and currently working as SRM attached to the Department of Electronics and India from 2018. So, Thank you for the brief introduction. I would like to introduce you all to the other speaker, uh, Dr. Shishendu Roy, founder and director of uh, Digital System Design and co-founder and director of Ad Auto Technology Private Limited. He completed his graduation and post-graduation in electronics and communication engineering from Indian Institute of Engineering, Science and Technology, IIEST Shipport, and was awarded PhD from National Institute of Technology, Rao Kela, in DLSI Signal Processing. He has published three international SCI index journals, filed one Indian patent, and published a book on advanced digital system design. Sir, we would like to invite you on the stage and please commence the workshop. <laughs> 